Hey gang, Sunday morning uh, weblog from Newman here. Uh, I'm listening to David Burns uh, classic country number two playlist. It is awesome. I found a couple of songs that I like. That's what I like about the South. Um, all kinds of cool stuff. And then this creepy song, the Loven Brothers, Knoxville Girl about a murder. Nuts. Anyway, um, I was working on this uh, fixed positioning page here on Code Academy, and um, I was pretty stoked about this whole whole idea of the um, you know what I typically do, which is this uh, inspect element with Firebug, and you know it brings up this, and I kind of mouse around and like I use this thing to go there, but then I noticed that using the keyboard you can scroll through this so I'm like just hitting the left key key so I'll get all the way to the top and now I'm just hitting the right key and I'm just scrolling through like this is this is just hitting the right key so navigating with the with the um, uh, with the keyboard you can kind of it's you know, so if I wanted to get to where those, like the fixed elements hover, like I can go in there, and then there's the section. I'm going into the section. Okay, there's the breadcrumbs, uh, section views, section details. Okay, interesting. Footer. Oh, well, where is that in there? Is it in the script somewhere? Anyway, uh, using these... Um, uh, you know, you can use the keyboard and you can use this. So if you can highlight there and then you can go with the keyboard. Anyway, the keyboard's great. Um, also, you can show and hide with F12, not F print. Um, anyway, so when I was, okay, so continuing on with this web log. Bah, F12, bring it back. No, that's not it. Oh. Okay, I got it. I hit the F lock key, which is right there. I'm using this. Uh, kooky Microsoft keyboard and which I love actually it's sort of split but not all the way split anyway F12 bringing well now it's not working again okay once you're in the thing F12 brings it up and down and the keys I've talked to you about that and then what did I do so if you if you get in here I uh, what I do I got into the header I went into, where did I, oh, I was in the head. I was in the head and I found like a script. And then if you, if you right mouse click here, you get all of this sort of stuff. And I'd love to go into this because I feel like these are like power user tools for Firebug. And I don't know exactly how they all work, but I, I did this one and I was like, oh, okay. Um, this is some type of script. So I copied that out and got this one. And I'm like, oh, okay. Uh, and I turned it in the language over to JJJ JavaScript. And this got me some color coding. But I was wondering if there's something in here that you can format the text. So I'll go over here and do format, format with notepad Excellent. auto format there you go anyway we'll see how this turns out this looks interesting I so I found a stack overflow thread about it and then you know basically saying I you know wanted to um, so they got this wait a minute Okay, here we go. So maybe this is what we want. And so this is what we get from this jsbeautifier.org, which looks to be pretty awesome, actually. Um, we'll have to put this up. Anyway, um, I'd like to dive into this, but I am coming to the end of this five-minute time allotment. Uh, enjoy, and see you next time. Bye.